Uh, good evening, I'm Steve. I've known a jockey since he was little. <laughs> That's my job. No, no, don't apologize. Just also don't talk. Uh, I missed my weekly creative thinking class, so I had to make it up. I bought a bunch of paper straws, you know, to save the earth. They all came wrapped in plastic. I think the earth broke even. I bet if sea bass studied harder, they could be a bass. <laughs> Make the bass on a roll. <laughs> Crazy weather. <laughs> so I'm a, I'm a really I'm a really weird guy. Like my favorite genre of music are sea shanties. So like if I'm at a party and someone says, Hey Steve, what do you want to listen to? I go, um, Do you have any songs about ships from 1778? No? Okay, how about that song that ponders the logistics of managing a drunken sailor? <laughs> no? Okay. Alright, just keep playing Sweet Caroline. I don't... God, it's Irish Kevin's all over again. Yeah, Sweet Caroline, more like Please End This Life of Mine. Speaking of life, uh, I was a really weird kid. Like, when I was a kid, uh, I thought that I could fly like Superman. And in order to test this theory, I stood on top of a couch and spread eagle leap straight off. I couldn't fly. But I did deter or did discover that I have a very Superman-like weakness. Like, you know how Superman is weak against kryptonite? Turns out, I'm weak against face planning tables. <laughs> I ended up splitting my upper lip and needing stitches, and now no hair grows directly beneath my nose. Like, thanks to a childhood injury, I can literally never be Hitler. <laughs> no, no, Hitler and I do have something in common. And that's that neither of us own a sloth. Uh, in my defense, owning a sloth is illegal. And in Hitler's defense, uh, he's a maniacal despot that's been dead since 1945. Not the ideal candidate for sloth ownership. Was that? I'm good? How am I doing? I'm doing great? Fucking oh, liar. Uh, I bring weather. Whoop! I, um, the, I bring up slots because slots are my favorite animal, and they're my favorite animal because they are mathematically perfect. Alright, crunch these numbers really quick. One, a sloth sleeps for 18 hours a day, and when it's awake, all it wants to do is eat and hang out. It's like having your own little adorable weed dealer. Except the sloth is ironically even more illegal. <laughs> Two, a sloth lives in a tree and eats leaves. The average cost to feed a dog over the course of one year is $250 to $700, depending on how much you love your dog. <laughs> People pay to get leaves removed. And three, a sloth goes to the bathroom once a week. Once a week, I'm not kidding you. Like, my sister owns a St. Bernard, and she has to wake up every morning at 5 a.m. to let him out. With a sloth, it's a calendar event. It's like, all right, Sunday, dinner with the parents. Right, Monday, open mic at Mary Ellen's, and everyone's attending. <laughs> Tuesday, Teddy Poops. By the way, Teddy is the name of my fictional sloth. It's short for Theodore Slozevelt. <laughs> like, with, with a sloth, you can give it a bath and then hang it up to dry. It, is, it's, it has its own clothes hangers, all right? It is its own hammock. The only thing that's wrong about a sloth is that there's really not that many. But I think we could fix that if we up our conservation efforts from relief to mass production. But I don't think we could do that because sloths are slow fuckers. <laughs> 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 oh, God, I
to just stand and look at my imaginary watch. All right, I got, I got one more joke. All right, one more and then I'll leave. Uh, I, I used to have an addiction to masturbation. Uh, guess what? I beat it. Thank you all very much.